हेलो ऑल लेट स्टार्ट विद एक्सरसाइज 1.3 क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इट सेज एग्जाम वेदर द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट आर ट्रू और फॉल्स सो इन दिस केस यू कैन सी वी हैव फर्स्ट वन एज ए बी माय फर्स्ट सेट इज ए एंड द सेकंड सेट आई विल बी कंसीडरिंग एज बी सो यू कैन सी हियर वी हैव ए बी इन सेट ए एंड वी हैव ए बी इन सेट बी सो देर फोर वी कैन से दिस इज द फॉल्स स्टेटमेंट वाई बिकॉज A is a subset of B. The right statement is A is a subset of B because we have both the elements in the set P. Now the next one we have A E is a subset of X is a vowel in the English alphabet. So in this case you can see again my set A is a subset of B because in set set B we have all the vowels that is A E I O U. so we have all the vowels so therefore we can say that a is a subset of b so this is true the first one is false now moving on to third part we have 1 2 3 it's a subset of 1 3 5 now you can see we have 1 we have 3 but we don't have 2 so therefore this is again a false statement because the first the first set is not a subset of b now the fourth part we have a subset of a b c yes it is true why because a belongs to the another set fifth part says we have a set a and here we have a sign of belongs so in this case we have another set as b that has that has a b and c so in this case you can see a is actually the first one the first set is actually a subset of second set but there is no relation that it does we can't say that it belongs to b because it must be same so therefore it is a false statement now the sixth one says x is an even natural number less than 6 so what this set b it should be less than 6 and it should be a even number so it should be 2 4 and that's all now the next one we have x is a natural number which divide 36 it must be a natural number and it must divide 36 so it could be 1 it could be 2 it could be 3 it could be 4 it could be 6 it could be 12 it could be 36 it could be 18 as well so you can see 2 and 4 do belongs to the second set so therefore a is a subset of b therefore this statement is again true